Hey guys, it's Young Wealth. Now, wow, if we just look at the price of XLM right now, it's actually under 30 cents. See, when I see this price point, I see opportunity to actually expand your money. These we are looking at technology that is in its baby stages right now. We're in the early stage, we're in like Amazon in 2000, okay? Amazon in 2001, okay? We're in those type of stages. So when I see this technology, I'm thinking of always buying more. Now, you have to understand, this is huge, guys. Now, I just read this article over here right now. It says, IMF selects XRP and XLM as winners for the next financial system. Emergency Ripple XRP warning right now. You guys have to understand that the IMF, IMF stands for actually the International Monetary Fund, okay? Now, what do they do? You have to understand that IMF is a global organization that works to achieve sustainable growth and prosperity for all of its 190 member countries. It does so by supporting economic policies that promote financial stability and monetary corporations, which are essential to increase the productivity, job creation, and economic well-being, okay? Now, you have to understand, guys, that when we look at IMF's net worth right now, it's around a trillion dollars now. They are huge. When it comes to the financial markets, the IMF is a huge, huge company, right? And if they are saying xrp and xlm were the next winners for this financial system you best believe i'm buying a lot before the price pumps the points where it's no longer affordable because to be honest with you guys i don't want to have to buy one xlm for ten dollars let me say that one more time i do not want to have to buy one xlm for ten dollars that would actually hurt my heart a lot because it's to the point where when i look at the charts today it's down four percent when I look at a coin that's down 4%, such as XLM, I'm actually looking at that as an opportunity. I don't get scared. I don't actually run away from the problem. I don't think, oh, it's ugly. It's look, the charts are looking ugly today. I might have to sell my XLM. No, I see opportunity to buy more because at the end of the day, you have to gobble up as much XLM as possible. Not financial advice, but you want to gobble up as much as possible. So in the future, when XLM becomes a utility in the globe, you actually own finite technology, okay? You own a technology that's very valuable. If you look at the price right now, it's very undervalued. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. This is the reason why when I look at the chart and look at the seven day right now, we can see that we are pretty much in the same position we were seven days ago. And I don't see that as a bad thing. There's a lot of holders that hold XLM and they are annoyed that XLM don't pump in a month. They are annoyed that XLM is going down and it's consolidating, it's very boring, but me, I just see it as I'm going to keep accumulating XLM because I know when it catapults and when it actually runs in the next bull run in 2025, that can set me a lot more financially capable than what I am right now. So I want you guys to understand that this is huge. The IMF actually selected XLM and XRP as a winner. Now, if we just read this, XRP and Stellar XLM have been identified as the chosen digital assets for the financial system with the potential to revolutionize cross-border transactions and reshape the international banking landscape. Guys, when you are talking about changing the international banking landscape, you are talking about trillions and trillions of dollars. So I want you guys to understand, when you see a token like XLM, at 3.3 billion dollars in market cap you have to look at the landscape of where it's heading that is a great opportunity right there to actually get into technology early before it takes off because i'm gonna be real with you guys when it comes to the system we have right now it's old and the next two best assets to actually change the system when it comes to the financial payments and cross-border payments and international transactions is simply xlm and xrp so I want you guys to understand that smart investors right now, they're accumulating these coins like XLM because in my humble opinion, there's a lot more coins that move quicker than XLM in the bear market. But when it comes to the bull run, I don't see no reason why this coin can't do a 15 to 20 X and actually 50 to 20 X on money and go to like $3.50. Okay. So when that happens, I cannot wait for that to happen because the amount of XLM I have right now 
it's enough to chill for a good second. It's enough to actually say, you know what, I can take trips abroad. I can actually do things. I can buy certain assets to make more multipliers of money. And I can go ahead and actually live my life a lot more happier because I would have more money due to the excellent profit taken I do in this next bull run. So with that being said, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is a short one. I want you guys to understand that we are in an upcoming bull run. So be prepared because you never know when the markets will take off and you never know when XLM will take off. So when you see it at 12 cents and not financial advice, don't get scared. Don't say, can it go down to 10 cents? Because at the end of the day, we are talking about a coin that can be worth double digits in the future. So I don't really care about buying at 13 or 12 cents. I don't care about the difference in price. I'm just buying when I can buy, okay? So with that being said, it was actually Young Wealth. If you guys enjoyed this video, hit the sub button, hit the like button, and I'll be back later on with another one. Peace.